Hello, Clifton, wherever you are. I hope your summer's safe, summer's warm, surrounded by love, light, happiness, joy, abundance, and filled with so much faith. Real quick, can you do me a favor? Can you hit that like button? Please hit share if you'd like to share it. And um, hit subscribe and turn that notification bell on to all so you can always be updated whenever I put another message out there for you guys. And if you'd like to donate, you do not have to. It's not a requirement, but it is. Truly appreciate it. The information is in the description box down below. And thank you from the bottom of all, with all my heart. I had time to anybody and everybody who chooses to do so and who has been. Thank you, thank you, thank you. May God bless beautiful souls tenfold. It's so funny. I've been telling Clyde. I was like, Clyde, your fans um, been missing you. They've been, <laughs> they've been asking for you all day. So you're going to come make an appearance? And I was like, hold on. I'll tell you when we're getting ready. And I didn't even get to tell him I was ready. <laughs> as soon as I put the camera up, he comes jumping down. <laughs> So that means you know, you're gonna get good luck too when a cat shows up. It means good luck. You okay? You're getting good luck coming on. All right, guys. Um, let's see what's going on. Yo, but yo, um, remember how I've been asking y'all to, to go to go help out Intuitive um, Heathen, who just starting his channel. He's fucking absolutely amazing. Yeah, I just discovered myself. He has a book out, dude. That is a major fucking accomplishment, bro. Like I am so proud of you. Um, you can check it out. It's called. Hold on, let me see. Um, free, free to King Fate, and if you go on his community board, right? Um, Intuitive Heathen. You go onto his community board, and you hit, you know, you'll see that the thing for it. You can order it, the ebook for nine ninety nine, and on, on, or you can go like to Amazon and you can buy a paperback. But yo, I was just looking this up, right? Check out that's his book right there. That's fucking a major accomplishment, bro. For real, for real. That's fucking amazing. Um, but yo, you know what's crazy? um i was seeing right here right it says mickey yo i don't know if bro if you were if you watched the video i did just the other day remember when i got the phone call um for the lady who had my phone my number before um i did remember her son called um the school called me and i was on i was doing a reading i didn't want to like if some told me to say the last name the last name was mickey but I was like, nah, nah, nah. Um, and I still be getting calls for fucking Mickey, um, for that, for her all the time. I, and I've had this number for like a few years now, but I still be getting calls for her. But that's, that's funny. And I just looked at, you know, the author, you know, the, that's crazy as fuck. So I, I'm strongly feeling like you were destined, you were definitely destined to come across me and to, you know, um, and that's why you resonate so much. And that's just so fucking funny. If you remember, if you've seen that reading, um, I feel like there was definitely a reason why, you know, that reading, I feel like, um, was definitely for you, whatever that reading was. If I hope you've seen it, I'm not sure. It was literally just the other day. And I had, to, um, I was, you know, I had a phone call and I thought it was the cemetery calling me, but it was actually the, the charter school or whatever it is that her son goes to. That's so fucking crazy. And I've been telling them that I don't have that number no more too. But that shit is so crazy. And you know, their last name is Mickey. And I like I was looking at that and I was like, yo, that's fucking crazy. I was like, I wasn't even doing another reading. But two days in a row, homie, you got me to do another fucking reading <laughs> when I wasn't going to. Because once I seen it, I was like, oh I gotta do a reading, I gotta say something to him. <laughs> but yeah, guys, check him out. And he has a fucking book out, dude. That's amazing. And you can even like look. You can just go bang. Like, I was already checking, look, you can even, like, pre-read a little bit of it. You can order the ebook for $9.99. You can go on Amazon. Um, and if this book looks interesting. I only got, to, like, I literally just, you know, looked at it, just scanned it, like, like, like you know, scanned through, like, whatever, you know, like, did a little, real quick over it. Like, but there is, where's it said over here, if you click on, you can either order it right there for $9.99. Hold on. Yeah, you can get the ebook, so it's right on your phone, or if you hit right underneath of it, the little blue one you can order i don't know why it's not zooming in there it is you can um order on amazon barnes and dude yeah that's out on fucking barnes and noble dude that's a major books um books a million that's a major accomplishment homie that's a fucking amazing um accomplishment bro i'm proud of you dude that's fucking awesome yeah you can get it for 9.99 on here or like i think but when i went to go click on it the paper, oh, wait, other format, yeah, the, the, be careful, because this is like the, um, I guess for ebook way, but if it says right here, for, um, other format, oh shit, wrong thing, other format, you want the paperback, if you want to, like, actually order the book itself, you see right here, and you can do it for 10.89 on Prime, that's fucking amazing, dude, that's, I'm, I'm proud of you, dude, that's a fucking amazing accomplishment, 
so yeah, I just wanted to get on here and, and like, you know, help promote his book. Um, God, check him out. That's fucking, dude, I'm so proud of you. That's fucking amazing. And keep showing up, homie. Just keep showing up, okay? Um, I know it's been a couple of days since you posted. Just start showing up like every day. I'm telling you, because so that you'll get the algorithm, okay? If you, if you post videos every day, you'll get the algorithm where, um, you know, they'll put your, your, your stuff out more, okay? So you'll get more subscribers. And guys, please go, please go check out, um, intuitive intuitive heathen on youtube check him out he's fucking absolutely amazing this is his channel right here help him get up he's just starting his channel so um go give him some love and support i don't think you can zoom in yeah well we got you double the subscriber that you had than you had uh, yesterday which is good um yeah please go show him some more love and support and now bro you can even do you can go live now because you have 50 um you have you have over 50 subscribers and you have this like like such an amazing captive like captivating voice, bro. For real, like you you bring people in with your voice. Um, you're gonna make it big time. I'm telling you, you already fucking have a book out that is so fucking amazing. That is so amazing. I've been wanting to write a book for so long, but I I just don't I don't even know how to go about doing it. Cause I like you know I want like my life is literally like a fucking movie. A lot of our you know a lot of our lives are dude. That's so inspirational. That's fucking amazing. I am so proud of you check him out guys you know go subscribe to his channel intuitive heathen um if you go onto his community board that's where i found uh that's where i found what the fuck's going on here uh, that's where i found the um that's where i found the book yeah right there if you go down to the, you know the second thing on his community board you can go and you just hit more read more and then you click on the blue thing you can order his book Dude, that's fucking awesome. I am so proud of you, bro. I'm so, so proud of you. That's amazing. All right, guys, maybe one user, maybe somebody's going to be writing a book, okay? There's a reason why this is all coming out as well. Um, but that's just so crazy because that last name, too. And that's, <laughs> I'm telling you if, you, if you didn't see that reading, it was just the other day. I think it was like yesterday. No, it was like two days ago, I think. Um, and I had a phone call, and it was, I thought it was a cemetery calling um, for my mom's grave soon. She passed away in 2015, but... My stepdad, that she, the one who she was engaged to when uh, she passed away, he was in prison. He got out of prison, and he ended up buying her um, a gravestone. He's back in prison now, though. I don't think he's getting out of prison. Um, from what I heard, I don't think he's ever going to get out of prison. But um, some, but ooh, someone's going to prison for the rest of their life. Somebody's going to end up going to prison for the rest of their life. All right. See how all these downloads are just starting to come in together. All right. Let's see what's going on, guys. Somebody can be an art. This is the, um, this is the, this deck is, like, inspired off of my favorite artist, um, Vincent Van Gogh. Somebody could be an artist. You might be, you know, you can even be, like, you know, musician or, like, be into painting or drawing art. Um, if you're an amazing artist, guys, and you don't know how to get your art out there, YouTube is an amazing channel. Uh, Gary, I've been telling my cousin Gary, someone's name could be Gary, um, start a YouTube channel, bro. Uh, he's such, like even doing um, tour to, um, you know, like the what are they called? You know, where you show how to draw. My cousin's like the best artist I've ever seen in my entire life, and and I swear he should be a comedian too. You could be a comedian. You could be really funny. Um, start recording just stupid funny shit, dude. Like you can you can promote anything. Like and literally anything can be promoted. Okay, and YouTube is such an amazing platform for that. Okay, guys, and I'm telling you, like I'm telling you, um, somebody needs to start a, a YouTube channel. All right. That fucking book, dude, that's amazing. All right, we have the Empress and the Hierophant. Yeah, dude, you're extremely creative. You're very fertile. Um, you're a spiritual leader. You're spiritually gifted. Um, yeah, this is beautiful. And you're extremely, um, you're extremely creative and extremely um, fertile in your spirit, whatever you're doing with your spiritual gifts. You might be fucking opening up your own, like, I don't know, something to do, like, maybe even a fucking church. I don't know. Or um, some sort of spiritual practice. Uh maybe youtube channel or your own like spiritual whatever you do like whatever you know um maybe like some sort of store or something or shop or you can even just do things on meditation guys there's so much things you can do it's insane um it's just it's just, it's just so insane youtube is such an amazing platform guys it really is all right let's see what's going on here 
Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, angels, ancestors, and loved ones that passed away. The higher fit and the sun, yeah. And everyone's starting to see, like, you, they're exposing, like, you know, um, it, they're starting to see, it's come to their the realization, you are this beautiful, divine, spiritual leader. You're extremely gifted, all right? Um, and it's being exposed, yes. You have, you're going to have a lot of happy, beautiful days coming ahead of you, okay? And with your spiritual gifts, especially because you're in your purpose, you know, especially when you're in, if you're not already in your purpose, you're about to be there. Um, your spirit, your, your purpose is something spiritual. It's to do something spiritual. You know what I mean? It's something that has to do something with spiritual, spirituality or religion or something. I'm not religious. I'm spiritual. Like, you know, I'm not religious. I'm, um, you know, I'm spiritual. Um, my religion is God and Jesus, you know what I mean? And the angels, ancestors, the ones passed away, uh, but you maybe maybe you're religious, maybe you're in a star. I don't know something like that. It's different for all y'all, but that's amazing. But um, also I'm strongly getting maybe there might be some sort of exposure coming to a a group, a cult, a secret society, a coven, or something like that that are being exposed as well. Maybe it's come to their you know realization that you are who you say you are. You know. Um, you don't even have to say who you are. They see it. It's, it's very evident. It's very clear. Beautiful. I mean, you're very genuine. You're very unique. You're very, um, authentic. Authentic, authentic, authentic. You're, yeah, very loyal to Seven of Cups. Yep. You're going to have so many opportunities coming your way with your spiritual gifts. Whatever you're doing with your spiritual gifts, okay? You're going to have so many fucking opportunities, all right? beautiful and I'm, so, I'm strongly getting to possibly you have like a, a group a cult secret society coven that is that feels threatened by um your gifts that's been attacking you they've been casting a lot of illusions your way um, whatever fucking weirdos get over it seven of pentacles Whatever you're investing in with your spiritual gifts are fucking flourishing beautifully. All right, plant them seeds, all right? Maybe you can even, maybe I'm strongly getting possibly part of your fucking purpose is to help other people find their purpose and get into their purpose. Help plant, like, the seeds in other people's heads. Someone's name could be Chuck, um, ch you know, Chuck, Chucky, Charles. Uh, that's just like planting a seed that got, reminds me of my Uncle Ruthless who's in prison. But, we, you know, his real name's Chuck. Somebody could be in a club. I don't fucking know. Um, but yeah, you hold the key, the sacred key you know, of knowledge, you know, wisdom and stuff as well. But yeah, I'm strongly feeling that might be part of your purpose as well is helping other people, planting the seeds to help um, other people. And if you're worried, like, oh, well, how am I going to do this? What am I going to do? Don't worry. God's going to gift you. Like he's going to, he's going to, um, you know, direct you into like the right, you know, with loyal friends, like loyal people that actually truly love you. They do things out of their heart, like, you know, genuinely that are going to help you, you know, help you along the way. He's planting the right people in your path that, that'll help you along the way. Okay. And it's confirmation, excuse me. And guys, if you're starting up something new, you know what I mean? If you have a YouTube channel and, you know, you're starting up whatever, just hit me up, leave in the comments, let me know, you are you know, you started a channel and I will gladly, you know what I mean? I'll, you know, make, give you a shout out and ask people to subscribe to you. I'm all about helping other people, okay? I'm all about helping, especially if you're just starting out, without a doubt, you know what I mean? Everybody's got to start somewhere. Um, why am I? They're spying on you. The page of swords. This, and maybe this group called Secret Society or Coven, they could be spying on you and whatever, we don't give a fuck. Um, but yeah, there's also that group, I feel like that they're being watched too, the group called Secret Society Coven, whatever this is. But yeah, dude, you're such definitely, you're, you're so extremely gifted. Just start start your channel if you didn't already. And if you did and you're just like worried because you don't, you feel weird, like all you gotta do is ask God, ask Archangel Michael and Archangel Raphael to remove any fears, um, and you're going to do um, cord cutting um, uh, meditations. There's frequencies you can listen to that actually that are, that do that. You, there's many different frequencies and meditations you can do. And you just ask, um, you know, you listen to that. You, you go in a state of meditation and you ask, um, you know, you can ask Archangel Michael or Archangel Raphael. You ask Jesus, like, you know, or ask God to, like, you know, just remove all fears, um, you know, and, and, and get rid because a fear is like is a, is a demonic thing that's you know it's it's a demon um you know that's attached to you 
and if you can slay that demon you're extremely gifted you can definitely slay the demons all right um and it gets it's a little nervous at first it's a little you know i mean if you watch my very first re like my very first video um it's a little nervous like you know especially because i was a person that did not like being on a camera i did not like get my picture taken um you know it was a little nervous but it wasn't bad at all and then i like after my first like couple videos i was like all right whoa you know, and then I was like, well, let me just do some of these meditations, because you cut, you know, cord cutting ones, and, um, you know, remove, I just asked, I asked Archangel Michael and Archangel Raphael to, uh, you know, please, please remove all fears, and I, and it just, like, I just, it was like, whatever, like, who gives a fuck, like, I don't even know why I even really care, like, what are you really worried about, like, it's just a nervous thing, you know what I mean, but then you just get used to it, it's like nothing, it's just, you know what I mean, and, like, think about it, like, especially, you know, at first, and when you first start a channel, you can't go live yet, you have to wait till you can go live, um, so all you're doing is recording. It's not like anybody's seeing you. It's not like you're not in front of somebody. All right. Um, it's just like you're just recording and you're posting it. It's not even if you want to go live, you can even block the comments, which if you're doing reading, guys, if you're channeling, um, like when I start, I remember I tried going live, but the fucking, the thing kept cutting in and out and I was just afraid to go, like for it to keep happening. It's because of people on my phone, the spyware, but, um, I'm going to start going live. I, I already have an idea of what to do to, um, to fix that situation um i just have to i'm waiting for a part to come in but um for something else and then i'm gonna try doing it again but um what i do um, what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna block the comments because um, to me anyway like i like to stay focused into the reading um so i'm gonna have the comments blocked or right, while i'm going live just so that it doesn't distract me or i'm just not gonna look at the comments and i'm just gonna stay focused into the reading all right so i don't get sidetracked and um but then when i post because you can do the live and then you post it still as a video as well so when people were unable to see it while you're going live it's still on your your you know so people can watch it later so i'm either gonna do that i don't know but that's an idea for some of you guys maybe you're worried about that um i don't know but yeah, somebody needs to start a YouTube channel. And if you guys need to have any questions or anything, just, you know, I'm still new to YouTube myself. But, um, I mean, I've been doing it for a couple months now. It's not that hard. It's actually quite easy, actually, to do. And it just, you know, all you got to do is remove the fears. And it's, I'm telling you, you, you and it also, it's like, just, just, just do it. Trust me, just do it. You're going to be so happy. You're going to be like, what the fuck was I, like, worried about? Like, there was no reason to, you know what I mean? Just trust me. Just, you're going to be like, damn, I should have did this a long time ago. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, and the ones that passed away. What does the collective need to know? What do they need to be aware of at this time? Please, thank you. King of Cups in the reverse. Ooh. It's probably your ex, possibly. Power, or yeah, your ex is going through some fucking chaos, destruction, upheaval, mayhem, or it's just somebody. I'm strongly getting it's your ex, or it's just some cold hearted, detached, like ruthless, um, type of person that you know, um, they're going through chaos, probably for what they put you through, is now coming back and biting them in the ass. Like, look at their house. Like, the house is, like, living right on the edge. And it's, like, it looks real shaky. Like, that shit's about to fall right off into that fucking water. Their whole fucking foundation's about to come crumbling down. Holy Spirit, divine spirit, angels, ancestors, and loved ones that passed away. What does the collective need to know? Thank you. Knight of Swords. They're not protecting. Yeah. This is on the fence. Knight of Swords on the fence. The hangman. And the four of wands on the fence. Um, okay, so we got the, the knight of swords. The hangman. And the four of wands. So your ex, or whoever it is, you know, king of cups in the reverse, very cold-hearted, detached person. Um, mm. Somebody might want to come in to protect you from them. Or this could be like the authorities even coming in to protect you from them because they're caught. We had the hangman. Um, four of Wands is talking about like your home front of stability. Something about a house or just like stability. Um, it would also talk about celebration, achievements, joy, and harmony as well. Um, maybe it could even be they 
they might even want to come in to protect you because they went inward with the hangman. It could be, you know, or they're caught. You're gonna have, and you, you could have reason to celebrate something about a house or a foundation. You're about to be in, like, you're about to, you know, be able to celebrate because you're getting some sort of achievement, you know, joy and harmony, okay? Um, it's like a, something like your foundation is going to be secure, stable, maybe because maybe you're going to find out they got arrested. That's what I'm only getting, maybe. Yeah, I feel like they're they're like, they're about to. That's why it was on the fence because they're about to. Uh, the authorities are getting ready to come in to slay them, slay that fucking demon right there, get rid of them, put them into prison because they're caught, you know, um, they're caught, yeah. And maybe commodity, maybe they got caught stealing a house from you. I don't fucking know. Something about a house. Maybe they're coming to knock the doors in. Or it could be even something even deeper, darker. Like I'm looking at this as like a floating body. Then I'm looking at this like what if they, you know, what if they did that, the, you know, the hanged man. Because they couldn't go on no more. They couldn't slay their demons anymore. Because they're going through chaos, destruction, kind of people, mayhem. You might find out someone took themselves out. Maybe in that pos maybe possibly that way, or there goes that body floating in the water. Remember that reading I just did? Maybe they got caught for that. That's what this is. I feel like I feel like this is the person that gets getting caught. Maybe they fucking they're arresting. Maybe this is the one that's getting arrested for that body. Remember, they're caught for that body. Remember the two the, the reading I just did yesterday with the where they're finding the body in the water, chained up, and then like the they're gonna go in the woods and they they find the fucking the, the woman in the woods that he buried. And like this is gonna, you know, they're, so they're gonna arrest him, and this is a person that's been doing the most to you. Like they've just been, you know, attacking you so much. Um, now they're gonna be put away, right? And you're gonna have peace, harmony. You know, um, you're gonna be here and have reason to celebrate. You're gonna like maybe possibly, you know, they might even be living in your fucking home. They could have stole a house from you or something like that. But you're gonna have reason to celebrate. I'm gonna tell you right now. I'm strongly getting that. You're gonna be in a lot of joy when you find this out. Yeah. Shit, maybe like fucking wherever they threw that body. Maybe like, I don't know, maybe like fishy started coming over, eating at the fucking things, and like somehow, like, maybe like I said, remember that somebody, it might have even been like two years ago, might have, I don't know, maybe the, the body ended up like floating up or something, and somebody found it or something. I don't fucking know, or that person on the bike possibly, but I'm strongly getting that's what this is right here. Or they're going swimming with the fishies themselves. I don't fucking know. Maybe they're taking themselves out. And when they do, it's going to be, it's either like the authorities are picking them up or they're going to do it themselves because they can't slay their demons anymore. Um, they're living in utter darkness. Because this person's going to eventually, um, either they're eventually going to end up taking their life or um, someone's going to do it. You could be a Pisces. You don't have to be, or you could be a water sign, but I'm seeing like the, the koi fish. That's also good luck, just like how Clyde showed up. Um, whenever Clyde shows up, that's, you know, when the cat shows, it's it's good luck. So you're going to definitely have good luck. Unfortunately, like koi fish um, are good luck. All right. You could be a, um, a Pisces, you could be or a water sign, or this person could be a, a water sign, possibly. Someone's initial could begin with a P. I mean, I mean, name could be a P or E. It looks like it could possibly be a P or it could be an E. It could be a J. If I flip it up this way. Someone's initial could begin with a J. It could be a P. It could be E. Peg. Someone's name could be Peg, Peggy, Margaret. This could be someone's name. Your name, their name, somebody involved. Yeah, Seven of Wands, you're heavily protected. And I'm telling you, take that leap of faith. God has your back. Look, like... God has your back, you know what I mean? Like, this is going to be you, like, taking that leap. Like, you know, look at all that water, right? And you got them sticks, and this is how you feel right now. You feel like, what do I do? Like, you know what I mean? You could be, this is how you could be feeling. Like, fuck, what do I do? Like, I know this is what I should be doing, but, you don't, you know, or if you're in a weird situation, you need to cut somebody off or something, you just don't know how to do it. Spirit's telling you, do it. Like, I got you. You can be like this. Like, look, you know, somebody ought to be crazy by doing it, but they're not. And they're able to make it because they know God has them, the universe has them. 
them. God's pushing, you know, God's going to make sure you make every, you land every, you know, little stick that's there. You're going to make it there, okay? And you're, because you're protected. Seven of Wands is protection. It's also quick communication as well you're going to be getting. You're going to get some sort of quick um, communication. Hmm. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit. That could even be R. Someone's name could be Jer, J E R, you know. Jer, Jerry, Gerald. J, if you spell it J A E, because that can kind of look like somewhat like an A too. Someone's name could be just J or something, or it could be a game with a J. I don't fucking know. Y'all know your name's not me. <laughs> and that's good enough for real that it could be like, someone's initial could begin with a C. It looks like a C right here, or an E. It's her Craig. What up, Craig? Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, my ones that passed away. What is the collective need to know? What do they need to be aware of at this time? Please and thank you. You need to cleanse your area. You need to get some Palo Santo stick. Um, somebody like right now, like I'm like right now, if you if you have Palo Santo stick um, or sage, you need to light some. Somebody's sending you something negative right now. My, my left ear is blasting. Hold on a second, guys. You need to cleanse your area. If you have any Palo Santo stick, <laughs> Or sage, um, say the Lord's prayer. If you don't, if you don't, just say the Lord's prayer, okay? Someone's sending you something right now as we speak. I rebuke it in the name of Jesus. Of course, the candle like all the way low. Don't worry, guys. You are protected, alright. But just so you know, someone's sending you something right now. They can go fuck themselves, though, because I return that shit right back to sender times a hundred. Hold on, my bad guys. Can I close that up for you? No, uh, returned to sender times a hundred. In Jesus' name, I pray. Alright guys. Yeah, somebody's sending you some negative shit right now. They can fuck themselves up. Well, oh, bitches. They a bunch of bitches. That's all they are. Alright. Let's go on, my bad guys. Here's the shell. I don't know where my little thing is right now. Alright, where did I just put that? My bag is there. Alright. Oh, look, the world. <laughs> what, what goes around comes around, man. You're getting good karma. Um, I mean, they're getting bad karma. You're getting good karma. It's a completion. It's the end of a cycle. I don't know why I was just thinking Wheel of Fortune. I meant this is this is the world, not Wheel of Fortune. But um, I guess you're getting that too. <laughs> but it's a completion. It's the end of a cycle. Yeah, someone's getting caught up. This person's getting caught up. I guarantee it's for that body. Body, yaddy, um, what, what's it? Uh, Mozzie, does anybody feel it? Uh, maybe you listen to Mozzie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ozzy, because it'd be someone's name or nickname or some shit. Seven, well, look, okay, there we go. This is just spirit con confirming you. You're protected from whatever these motherfuckers are trying to do you and whatever they're just trying to send you. They can go fuck themselves. You know, you turn that shit right back to the sender. It's not, it's not welcome here. Do not pass go. Do not collect $200. Go straight to fucking hell, motherfucker. Um, have fun with that, you know. You are protected. Your home is protected as well. You're you're protected. Your home is protected. Your family is protected. Well, at least not the the ones that are not karmic. Okay, <laughs> King of Pentacles. You're about to be in this King of Pentacles energy if you're not already. Very financially stable. You got the bull by its horns. Like you know what I mean. You're ready to go. All right. Um, whatever you're doing, your spiritual gifts keep on doing it, boo, because you're about to be this King of Pentacles if you're not already very reliable, very responsible. Um, somebody needs to eat some more fruit too. You need to start eating more fruit and veggies, okay? Start drinking more water. More water. You need water. You need fruit. You need veggies. Um. Yeah. All right, Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, and Loved Ones. Somebody could really like strawberries. The strawberries are just sticking out to me, like, very heavily. Check your strawberries. You might have, like, mold on them or something. If you have them, be careful. Check them before you eat them. Always rinse them off. Always rinse your fruit before you eat it. 
tower of chaos, destruction of people, mayhem. Maybe it's this. It's this fucking. Well, definitely this King of Cups <laughs> in the reverse. They might be a King of Pentacles as well. They might have money, but they're. I feel like it's not. It's not gonna. It's not gonna last long. They're losing it because it was never their money to begin with. It's probably your fucking money that they stole, piece of shit. Mhm. Mm but they're going through chaos, destruction of people, mayhem. What's your divine spirit, angels, ancestors, and loved ones that passed away? What does the collective need to know? Somebody could be taking shrooms or acid. They could be like on some sort of trip where they could have got a bad batch of whatever they do. Um, they could like if they do meth. I'm, I'm strongly getting someone's getting a batch of flocka. F L A K K A. Um, if you don't know what that shit is, you might want to Google that shit. Um, somebody could like Dane Cook. That was you know from Dane Cook's skit. I mean, he's like Google that. <laughs> fucking love that dude. Yeah, seven, um, eight of swords, I mean, sorry, eight of swords, someone's going to fucking prison, bitch. Yeah, like I said, this is that, that's what it is, you're going to find out that, that this person is getting locked up, it's this, the authorities coming to get them, they can't fight no more, they can't slay their demons no more, no, the fucking authorities are coming to get them, to take their ass right to prison, they're caught for, um, they're caught possibly in their house, maybe they've raided, remember I told you, they're going to be raiding their house, right, they're going to fucking maybe possibly, um, get caught in their house, maybe they're coming to raid them in their house, um, you know, you're protected, it's like the protection, it's like the authority is coming in to protect you from them. They're going to come and fucking arrest these motherfuckers. Lock them the fuck up. They're going to throw them around like a little rag doll. <laughs> like, you're here, you little bitch. <laughs> and lock them into a prison cell, you little fucking bitch. <laughs> Give them a good one, two for me, please. <laughs> Fetty Wops, when you get them, do it. I mean shit like don't lose your jobs or anything but just give me a wink and a little smile let me know like all right so this way i'll know you did it like all right good look bro <laughs> pound that shit up blow it up make it rain <laughs> you know what i mean <laughs> someone's getting locked up though <laughs> you're a high priestess you're extremely gifted you're extremely you know um extremely extremely um uh spiritually gifted and powerful you might like pomegranate there's a pomegranate right there there's something definitely big about fruit here you need to start eating more fruit Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, and Loved Ones that passed away. What's the collect you need to know? Seven of Swords. Yeah, they're going to prison because they stole some shit from you. Possibly this house. They're caught. From, they're caught. Seven of Swords. Look. <laughs> 87 could be significant. Okay. Um, this King of Cups is getting locked up. His authority is coming in to arrest their bitch ass and lock them up. Put them in prison because they're caught for something about a house. Either they stole this house or they're going to get caught in their house. Alright, the cops are coming in to protect you. God is protecting you. God has his earth angels in the justice system to make sure that these motherfuckers go down. And they're caught for what? I'll tell you what. For stealing um, whatever they stole from you. Possibly a house. Possibly an inheritance. Um, they're trying to possibly fucking get you unalive you. And I'm, str I'm, I'm strongly getting too about this fucking body. It's, I, I'm strongly getting that, that that person. That they're getting caught up for that shit. And they're going to get locked up for the rest of their life. And I won't ever let them bitches out. That's for damn sure. So his name could be Jim James. Yeah, magician. Them fucking, they're manifesting this shit. You're manifesting this. And um, they were doing some sort of magic to try, yeah, to, like I said, yeah, I would do, like before I could even get the words the fuck out. They were trying to do some fucking, um, some, some magic to steal your gifts, right? To, uh, to end your gifts, right? To end your forward movement. Um, they want to apologize now because they're little bitches. But, um, and they know they're going to prison. They know that fucking, and when they get arrested too, they're going to get arrested with this fucking, um, voodoo doll they have of you too. They might have already, um, maybe they are locked up. You're going to hear about this shit. Yeah, they fucking, you might have been like me and woke up with a holy fucking, <laughs> holy moly, you had a fucking mullet. <laughs> like I did one day. Sort of. Okay. I woke up one day, <laughs> woke up one day, bro, <laughs> I had a fucking mullet, and I was like, what? 